proportions. So proportion says that two ratios or fractions are equal. So when two ratios or fractions are equal, then we say that they are in proportion. So let's take an example. So here blue to yellow ratio of blue to yellow balls is. So ratio of blue to yellow is 3 is to 1. And here the ratio of blue to yellow is 6 is to 2. So here ratio of blue to yellow is 6 is to 2 which in simplified form which in simplified form is how to make it simplified you can divide them with the same prime number so that prime number start with the 2 so 2 1 the 2 2 3 the 6 so in simplified form it is equal to 3 is to 1 ok so now since these two ratios are equal so they are in proportion and can be written as since above two ratios are equal so they are in proportion and can be written as 3 by 1 is equal to 6 by 2 because this ratio, this ratio can also be written in fraction like this and this can be written like this in fraction. So these two fractions are equal. So these two ratios are equal so their fractions are also equal and that's why they are in proportion. So since the two ratios are same so they are in proportion and can be written as 3 by 1 is equal to 6 by 2. So proportion can be in the ratios of different units. So when we talk about different units, so we talk about that different units cannot be added, subtracted, multiplied, but they can be in different ratios, they can be divided. Okay. So for example, see if a rope of 20 meter weighs 20 kg then a rope of 40 meter weighs iska kitna weight hoga of course iska double hoga 40 kg so we can take it take these two as proportions so 20 meter divided by 20 kg so this is the ratio this is the ratio 40 meter divided by 40 kg you cannot cut them because these are two different units you cannot cut it okay the two numbers cannot be cut because the units are different but these two are in proportion because in simplified form this is equal to 20 by 20 So what I said is you cannot cut it. It means that you can cut the numbers but units cannot be cut. Okay. So the you can cut it with the prime number. So in a simplified we can further simplify it. We can further divide it by 2. But now these two ratios are equal. So 20 meter divided by 20 kg is equal to 40 meter divided by 40 kg. Or similarly, we can also write that 200 meter divided by 200 kg. So this is also equal. So these all ratios are in proportion. So again I am repeating the two ratios of fractions. 
So these ratio can be also represented in the form of fractions. So when the two ratios or fractions are equal, then they are in proportion. Let's solve some question related to proportion in the next chapter.